13 love, 13 lies, 13 wisdom, 13 respect. This is your creation 13. Have you ever went out into public and just asked people, hey, how are you? Just a stranger, just out of the blue, say, hey, how are you? How's it going? Um, I guarantee you probably haven't. Uh, if you know me, that's what I do. I ask everybody, how are you? How's it going? Uh, and see what kind of interaction um, I get from it, right? Because there's a lot of people don't acknowledge people, right? I've noticed unless if you know them, if you know somebody, you don't acknowledge somebody you don't know, right? Oh, that's supposed to talk to strangers. Well, this is a good exercise on on learning about energies and opening yourself up to an interaction you may not have normally had, right? You may not have had an interaction with that person if you didn't say, hi, how are you? How's it going? And continue from there, right? Um, I've been doing this for a long time. And me personally, I'm going to go to, that, to the next step um, and just see what kind of interactions uh, unfold from that, right? Because ultimately, if we can talk to strangers and get to know them and say, hey, how are you? And if they open up and they're struggling, you know, you can help them right there, right? And at the end of the day, it comes down to what? Love and compassion and helping that person if they do break down um, to help them get to where they need to be or find out what they're wrestling with um, and go from there, right? Um, and it's just reaching that state of maturity in that interaction, right? Um, and basically, you know, it, it goes outside the realm of just the religious perception because that that's one thing, one thing uh, Christianity has over um, just an average person, right? Um, in terms of of religion, right? Uh, and then you got the average people. Then you got people who are are in that spiritual realm, right? The spiritual practices. Um, they go up to and talk with people, but again, they sell you stuff um, to get you to repent instead of of sitting down like Christ would, right? Christ would talk with people and get to know them and find out what is running their suit, what is running their vehicle, um, is ultimately what you're looking for, right? Who's running the suit? Who's running your life? Are you the main driver of your suit, your body, or is there other entities that are running your suit? And that's how you would find out, right? If people open up to you. Um, so I encourage you to say hi to people and study the energies. Trust me, there are some people I don't say hi to because I can feel the energy. I know if I make eye contact, that's huge. Let me, I'll make a video about just eye contact next. But if they make eye contact with you, they can send you a little little hook, a little spirit or parasite and attach it to you. So be very cautious of who you say hi to and feel the energies out. So um, that's a good practice to help you guys fill out the energies. And if it doesn't feel like harmful, then say, hi, how are you? How's it going? And see how that interaction unfolds. Um, cause trust me, there are so many people out there in the world that really would like for someone to say hi, for someone to care for them, someone to show them love and compassion. They're out there waiting for someone to do that, right? And I speak from experience, right? Before my awakening, you know, that's what I looked for. Um, is that, hey, how are you? How are you doing? Type thing. So I present that to people because I never experienced it. 
So now I encourage you guys to do the same thing because there's people waiting for you to say hi. And you never know. You could get a best friend out of it. You could get a co-worker out of it. You know, there's something beautiful that could happen by just saying hi. How are you? So I'll leave it at that. So love yourself. Keep shining bright. I'll talk to you all later.